know, it's always like that. <laughs> All right, guys. So <clears throat> I hey guys. decided to try something that I've been thinking about for a while, and that's this little white cup of joy. This is homemade uh, rice pudding. I used sugar-free Jello mix, cinnamon, vanilla, and then white rice. No sugar. Um, it should be it should be good, but then again, it could be complete garbage because the only sugar-free Jello I had was cheesecake. It might be Hello, good. Hello, Paisley. Though. It might be good. It it Hello, smells Paisley. really good. What's up, Andrea? Oh, Andrea, you were buffering already. On and the here's the deal. Here's the deal. I'm not very hungry tonight, so I am gonna try air fried pizza as well. This is left over from last night, so that's why there's not a whole lot on my plate. And I'm probably going to be trying some he of Kathy's salad. He wants to eat sal my salad. Yeah, that's what I want <laughs> out of everything here. I want the knots in the salad. I would have made you a salad. I know I wasn't. I'm not hungry. I'm. I'm really not hungry. Here's the problem when you eat so much on the weekends like I do. By Sunday. Especially if you don't really work up a big appetite, which I did my run tonight, but it, hey, JG. I didn't work up an appetite. What's up, JD? Your your GG made the best rice pudding. Actually, that's some that's kind of funny that you said that, Paisley, because we were just talking about Jamie's grandma's rice pudding. She made the best rice pudding. Yeah, my grandma made incredible rice pudding. I looked pudding. forward to that rice pudding at like Thanksgiving and Christmas. You want to slide <laughs> your salad over a little bit, and sure. then you could show them. So I have a salad with um, balsamic vinaigrette, lettuce, tomatoes, red onions, fresh mozzarella, and some roasted red peppers. Jamie, something looks different. Did you cut your beard? Who asked that? Paisley. Ah, looks different. Did you cut your beard? I trimmed my beard hey Marie. on Friday night. I think Friday night, yeah. I, my hair's up tonight because I just didn't. That's probably why I, you could notice it now. But yeah, I trimmed it. I trimmed it a, a great deal on Friday night. Hold my, was it Friday or Saturday? I don't remember. It was yesterday. yesterday. No, I did two streams. No, so it was Friday. Friday. Uh, hello, Marie. Hello, hello Marie. everyone. Hello, Betty. Thank you, Marie. Hey, Trisha. Why do you think it looks better this way? I'm. I'm more. I like the the, the rough and tough. Grizzly beard, but it was getting to You're the missing point. The I am missing the olives. I don't have any. It was getting to the point where it, it just, I felt very, I couldn't enjoy my food. Every time I would drink my shake, it would be all in my beard. And <laughs> Thank you, Strawberry. Uh, I don't think I'm going to shave for the rest of the winter, so I think, <laughs> I'm serious. I, I'll, I'll keep well, the it, sides neat. I feel like neat. it grows back pretty quick anyway. It does. Yeah. I'll have the big, hey, Trish. beautiful chocolate beard back by February. Any tips with one meal a day? I started yesterday. Yeah, stay stay consistent with it. Tricky Mickey. It's gonna be hard if you feel yourself getting hungry during the day. Have a cup of black coffee. Uh, do you just got? It's something to get used to. You know, it's not everybody could just jump into it and then be successful. So if you have to give yourself a little something, something for the first couple days, couple weeks, do what you got to do. You'll get it. Hey Chastity. Hey Chastity, I'm waiting for him. Trisha, how have you been, girl? It's been a while since we talked to you. To be honest, you look kind of boyish in a good way. Cute. You know what, Paisley? I told Kaki when I did it. I told Kaki when I did it, I didn't like it because I felt like it made me look a, a little bit more feminine. And she's like, and I'm, and she's like, what? I'm like, I'm like, at least when I had the big grizzled beard, you know, it kind of, I, I could get away with wearing the, 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 the bright colors and the makeup and the booty shorts. And now I just, I feel a, a bit more feminine. I don't know. You want to see Kaki with dark hair? I like me with dark hair. Jamie does not like me with dark hair. Hello, Court. How you doing, ma'am? Hi, Cortland. Can I have a shout out? I'm 50 today. Well, happy birthday, Kathy. Happy 50th. TikTok or YouTube? TikTok. Kathy, Kathy Bailey Waltz. Happy birthday, Kathy. Hey, Kathy, I like your name. I'll do you one better. I will sing you happy birthday. You said you're 50 years old. My <coughs> my mom turned 50 years old like 10 years ago. Hey, Chrissy. So I know, <laughs> I know that is a very special number. So I will sing you wow. a happy 50th birthday. I got a fancy, fancy microphone. Nice, Tris. That's awesome. I heard it was good. <coughs> Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy 
Happy birthday, dear Kathy. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Kathy. Happy birthday. 50 is a very special number. Very special number. It's like the new 30. Jamie looking 10 out of 10. Just saying. Oh, thank you, Cortland. It's the Hulkamania headband. That's what's giving me any kind of positive manly looks tonight. Your mom is going to kill you? Yes. Why would she kill me, Trish? Because she's not 60. <laughs> I did not put olives in my salad, Paisley, because I didn't have any olives. Otherwise, I would have. <laughs> watch, watch you come in from the back with a fly swatter. You guys are early. You what's up, You locked the basement door, right? Attic, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Chooch, what's up, buddy? Hello, Gina. <coughs> Hello, Chooch. Check yeah, out we're Bob early. on YouTube. Overcame. Can't read that. He plays the drums. Where y'all from? What do y'all do? We're from New York. I wish I was there with y'all. I love the food. Thank you very much. Thank you. What brand of dressing? Someone um, wants to know. Hold on. I don't know, to be honest. I don't remember. Okay. Yeah, I wish I could take the credit for making Mom, this headband myself, but I didn't. Kaki ordered this for me on Amazon. I wanted a Hulkamania headband, guys. I'm still a home Hulkamaniac. Um, even though I'm not a kid anymore, Hulkamaniacs do grow up, but they still love Hulkster. Simply oh. 60 by Morzetti. So it's 60 calories a serving. It's actually really good. I used to get the, um, the Boathouse hey, Boat sure, Farm buddy. one was really good, but I can't find that one anywhere. <clears throat> Hello, MB. How are you, girl? Hi, Chrissy. What's happening, guys? How's everybody's, uh, how's everybody's, uh... How was everybody's weekend? Anybody getting ready to go back to work tomorrow? You were early tonight. What's for dinner? Yeah, you know, I, early. Gina, so I made a homemade rice pudding and then I have leftover pizza that I put in the air fryer with a couple garlic knots and then uh, Khaki Doo made salad. So uh, I really don't know why we're early tonight. We, we weren't doing nothing and... You know, it, is, it just is what it is. I do have to go back to work tomorrow, so <laughs> maybe it's a sign like, oh, you need to get to your, you get, need to get some extra rush because you're gonna get it tomorrow. Maybe. Uh, she had some whiskey, just chilling now, waiting for Diane to get mm -hmm. home to blow her gut. It's been a <laughs> it's long been day. It's been a long day. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's something to look forward to, Chooch. Oh, Chooch. Hi, Lisa. <clears throat> Hello, Lisa. How are you, girl? Uh, Sal looks tasty. Um, thank you, Tessa. <clears throat> okay. Anything you want to talk about tonight? I'm dreading the next three days. Yeah, I think you're gonna have. A, I think it's gonna be okay. What's up, uh, Tessa? I think you're gonna be all right. Hello, Cherry. Hello, Cherry. Let the Hello, feast girl. begin. Not so much a feast, but I'm curious to know how the rice. <laughs> should I do the rice pudding first? I'm curious as or to how that's going to taste. Or should I do the pizza taste. and garlic knots first? I'm curious on the rice pudding. Where is this? Where is this at, please? Oh, you mean like is a restaurant? Is it birthday? No. Yeah. My birthday is not until next month. Yes. Uh, uh, yeah, no, it's not a restaurant. This is um, our, our home. Victorian. Um, we don't talk about our jobs. What happened? What kind of work do you do? I look forward to Very watching proud. you both. I'm loving... Nice, Chooch. Loving the salad. Well, thank you, but we don't talk about our jobs. Yeah, we can't. I mean, we can, but I've had complaints. Oh, Chooch, that's great. That's awesome. <clears throat> yeah, if you're if you're new in here and you're wondering why we don't talk about our, like, our real-life jobs, I've had people call up my job and try to get me in trouble because they don't like me. So we just try to keep that side of things out of this side of things. Heki, how's your leg doing? Um, it's better-ish. It's not completely healed. Tomorrow's going to be a week. It still hurts, but I can move more than I could have the past couple of days, but it depends how I move. Like, if I move the wrong way, yeah, it hurts. And if, like, one of the kids, like, accidentally, like, kicks me in my leg, yeah, it hurts. <laughs> But I could definitely move more than I could have. Oklahoma in the like house. last week. Jesus. Hello, What's my up? MILF. How you doing, Hey, Munchkin. Bro? You are fun and, in and an interesting couple. Thank you, well, Victoria. Well, thank you. Oh, we got a duck that turned oh, into a swan. Oh, wow. Thank you. And um, I missed it. 
And it usually stays on the screen, but it didn't. It said M something. I'm, thank you very much for the gift. That was awesome. Thank you All very right. much. All right. Jamie works as a producer on Brazzers and Khakis <laughs> and a Pants model. Man, you know what? I would love... <laughs> I'm not even playing with you. I'd love to work for Brazzers. There you go. I really would. <laughs> and I would say yes. If they reached out to me and said, Jamie, you know what? <laughs> I think you would be a good fit for an upcoming scene. I would talk it over with uh, Kagi first, but I would definitely do it. Hulkster. Hell yeah. What's for dinner? <laughs> well, hopefully it gets better, pretty lady. Oh, thank you, Tessa. All right, here we go. Let's try this. Do we have a YouTube channel? Yeah, Sharon. Yeah, we're live on YouTube right now. Yeah, we're live right now. Mm -hmm. Hello, Callie Gal. Hello, Molly Sue. What is that? What Jamie's eating? Rice pudding. Homemade rice pudding. Good, bad, no? What? Yeah, chooch, it's homemade. Yeah, try it. It's good. It tastes like rice pudding with like a small cheesecake hint. I think I'm going to need more, more cinnamon, though. Me cleanse my palate. Yeah, yeah, try it. It's good. I was feeling kind of creative tonight, and I wanted to make a... Is the rice cooked, though? Yeah, it's good. Um, I guess this would be considered macro-friendly rice pudding. Yeah. It's good, right? I mean, it doesn't. For, it's not like regular rice pudding, but that's good. No, for... You know what? For eyeballing it, rest in peace, Bob Saget. I know, I heard. Yeah, that's really sad. A couple hours ago, I found out. It's crazy. Um, you never like rice pudding? Is, is it, it sweet? sweet? It's not overly sweet. It's not overly sweet, Chooch. I used the sugar free pudding, and uh, I used milk, and vanilla extract, and. Um, some cinnamon. Some cinnamon, yeah. I, yeah, that's pretty good. So, but here's the thing this is I, not something I thought had heavy about doing. I think right? it'd be better without the cheesecake, though. Yes. Uh, so if I do this again, which I'm going to because it was it's it's a it's a success, I would change out a couple things, right? So instead of using the cheese, <laughs> instead of, of using the cheesecake <laughs> sugar-free pudding, I would use vanilla. Number one. Uh, number two, instead of using uh, two percent milk, I would use almond milk. And number three, I would probably add a little bit of uh, maple syrup. Sugar-free maple syrup. <laughs> but other than that, yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty good. Tell me about your skincare routine, ma'am. Because your complexion is glowing and beautiful. Oh well, thank you. Um, I really don't have a skincare routine. Yeah, this is good. I just wash my face and I make sure I moisturize it, and that's really it. Said yeah, news today hit hard about Bob. Memories, Full House, and America's Funniest Home Videos. Yeah. Yeah, it's. It's always sad. Always sad. Cheers, like, Callie Gal. Cheers, girl. We just lost Betty White last week, and now Bob Saget. Um, I mean, the only thing... I mean, Bob Saget was 65 years old, which I didn't realize he was up there. In, 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 I mean, that's not old, but I thought he was... I guess because I... You know, he was someone I grew up on, right? Hold yeah, on, Chooch. I, I thought he was... I thought he was younger than that. No, he's definitely not, because he was... <laughs> He was, you know, at least in like his mid twenties when Full House was happening. Yeah, no, well, but you're a kid when you when that exactly, happened. Exactly, you're a kid. We're not kids no more. People don't remember that Ra that Bob, Bob Saget was raunchy. Yeah, as, yeah, he was. Well, I well, I think it oh, was that, very I, bad. Growing up, you don't know that, but then when you start to like get into the the comedy and you start to be getting into adult things, you realize, well, Bob Saget was a, mm. he was a little bit of a. What? I dropped 149 pounds, right? On every day. You're a great inspiration. Thank you very much. Who said that? Um, Bieber Pisces. I appreciate that. It makes me feel really well. And congratulations on dropping that weight. Dropping 150 pounds is a big... Uh... Oh, yeah. Sydney Poitier as well. That's another, another dude, loss. Dude, you look young. How old are you? Thank you very much. I'm 36. <clears throat> Uh, 150 pounds is a lot of weight. Anybody, listen, anybody that loses weight, whether it's 150 pounds or 30 pounds, congratulations. Because it took dedication, it took hard work, and it took consistency. So, you know, that's something you should definitely be proud of. I stopped alcohol on June 7th. I went from 265 to 190. Awesome. 
alcohol bloated me like crazy. Yeah, tell me about it. I wasn't. I was. I used to be an alcoholic. I feel like it's up, Christian. And anything carbonated is going to bloat you. Be careful because almond milk doesn't thicken. Good to know, Lisa. Uh. We didn't use almond milk because. No, I, but I said I was. I was going to. Our almond milk was expired. <laughs> yeah, but I, I, I asked Kaki, like, do we have almond milk? She's like, yeah, in the back of the fridge. So I go in the back. And I was like, make sure you check the date because it's been in there a while. She goes, she goes, I don't know if it's still good. And I look at it, December 25th. <laughs> so I made a cake for Diane tonight. I'm trying to thicken her. Her back up. <laughs> Aw. I heard she's doing well, though. Last time I spoke to, uh, here we go. I heard she was... Do me a favor, job. can you just scoot a little? I don't want to keep on... I want to finish my rice pudding because I do like it a lot. Okay. okay. Oh, should I go back and forth? No, I'm going to go. Can you just scoot a little bit of salad over on my plate for the knots? And I got to get up and get the cinnamon. Do you like oat milk? I never had it. Never tried it. Pizza ready? It looks interesting though. Chooch, how much longer do you got until Diane comes home? You rock. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. You know, guys, I was thinking about uh, a lot tonight on my run. I feel like you wanted her to move. No, no, no. no. I just <laughs> wanted some of her salad before she ate it. She kicked hey, Shirley. back with chocolate frosting. Boom, five pounds. 45 minutes. All right, we've got <laughs> some time. Um, That's if she eats the whole thing, right, Chooch? She's got to eat the whole thing. So here's what I was thinking about. Hey Shirley, going on a tweet, oh, and the reason I wanted to do it because I didn't, I didn't allow myself to prepare for it. I was running tonight, no wind, beautiful run. I, I enjoyed it a lot. And sometimes I get super duper motivated on uh, on these runs when the weather is just perfect and nothing's hurting on me. And I was thinking, like, what happens if I do my my normal seven miles, go home, do the eating thing. Relax a little bit and then go back out running. Once again, no number in sight. Just see how many out, how many miles I could get in within 24 hours. I'm thinking about doing that. I just don't know when. I kind of want to do it on a whim. Kind of, I don't want to prepare for it. I'm just gonna just do it. Yeah, do going on a 24 hour loop. Meaning, I'm not saying not sleep, but just get as many miles in as possible in a 24 hour period. So it it's would. It's a lot. It's a lot, but I don't know. We'll see. Jamie, what was your pace tonight? Nine minutes and change, Chooch? It wasn't a fast. It wasn't like super hey, crazy. Hey, Annette. How are you, girl? <clears throat> it wasn't super crazy, but. And trust me, I got a lot of relaxing done today. How are you guys? Have to say, you are my favorite live. Thank you very much. Aw, thank you. So is like running the majority the is is running the majority of your weight loss? No, look, no, no, no. I lost the weight before I started running. I just I running is my new thing that I love that I've been doing for what, two almost two years now. Yeah, it's been a while now. So I guess you could say running is not my passion, but it's something that I really enjoy and I love. Uh, I, I love knowing that. My running and and you know even my words get other people to start doing doing that you know which is you know really puts the cherry on the cake. Is that a scar? What what is it from? My my, my makeup? No, I I have I've got scars on my body but not on my face. Luckily, one time Kaki threw an ashtray at me. That didn't leave a scar though. Thank God. Hit me right in the back of the head. <laughs> One of those Dollar Tree ashtrays. Didn't break either. Nope. Definitely worth a dollar. I did 300 KB swings with 52 pound kettlebell and 100 pull ups. Can't do my 10 a.m. CrossFit because we were on a two, two hour, hour delay, delay for tomorrow. Oh, you guys are getting snow? What do you? Oh, he said we were getting snow. <laughs> I have three more days of remote learning, and I'm hoping for three more snow days in a row. Yeah, true story. Can't, listen, can I get you Three more that? snow days in a row, guys. Three more snow days in a row. <sighs> but one of the kids were calling their names. Uh, Kaki used to throw a lot of shit at me. 
She just threw a remote at me today. Oh, I did, because you were being a dick. <laughs> she ch she chucked it at me. I was oh, laying I down. Did. She chucked it at me hard. You said, I'm sick of your... I'm sick of you, and I'm sick of your nose. So I took the remote, and I... Yeah, it got me right in the elbow. It did. I have really good aim. <laughs> Get the belt. <laughs> What was she watching? She was watching Law and Order. I was watching Law and Order. I was, I was folding the laundry. I'm sorry. You came upstairs as I was folding laundry. I gotta I'm doing my, my housely duties that I have to do because if I don't do them, guess what? They don't get done. So I was watching something that I enjoy. That's something that I've seen before. That's my girl. <laughs> Let me tell you. Let me Pissed tell me you off. Why. I was like, ugh. Let me tell you why and what, what happened. I was just, I was just like kind of... Strolling around, and Kaki was upstairs. And I know, He's lucky it wasn't the chunkalo. <laughs> and I figured I would see what's up, say hello. So I lay down on the bed, and she's folding laundry. I'm like, are you watching this? She goes, yeah. I'm like, I'm gonna change it. She goes, no. I'm like, it's old. And she goes, no, I'm watching it. So then I'm like, you know what? I'm sick of you. I'm sick of your damn nose. And then whack. She throws the she throws the remote at me and then she picks up I the did, laundry baskets it. and leaves the room. I stormed out. We weren't fighting though. No, he was joking. I was joking. But yeah. it was at like a bad moment because I just had gotten done like yelling at one of the kids because they were being mean. <laughs> <laughs> so he was like the icing on the cake. I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna take all my anger out on you. What? <laughs> it was a playful mood, but she really got me good. <laughs> Oh, I love your nose. Hey, Dalton. What's up, oh, buddy? Oh, thank you. I'm glad somebody likes my nose. <laughs> I don't hate your nose. I just know it's a it's something I can mess around with. Like Kaki makes head of my Kaki makes fun of my forehead all the time. Hence, Only because you make fun of my nose. Hence why I wear a headband all the time. Kaki <laughs> gave me a complex. She was folding laundry in her favorite blue sweatpants. You grabbed her hair and poured spaghetti sauce all over her. <laughs> <laughs> Chooch, no. If he did that, he definitely would have gotten something way worse than the remote. <laughs> would you survive Squid Game? I've never seen it. Um, probably not. No. I watched Squid Game. Jamie did not. No, I didn't watch it. Uh, I know what it is, but I don't know like what kind of games they play in there. Did you make the rice pudding? I did. Homemade. Macro friendly, I guess. A la my me. grandma threw a remote at my grandpa and hit him in the head. He's okay. <laughs> my mom once smacked at my brother with a spatula and broke it over his ass when he ran across the street, ran away from her. True story. It happened right in Rockville Center, actually. We got home, and he didn't listen. <laughs> he just kept on running. Could have got hit by a car, so you could understand why my mom was bad. And uh, pulled out a wooden spatula, cracked it right over his ass. He started laughing. <laughs> right in that, anything can be used as a weapon. Be careful what you say, Jamie. Oh, depending on how long you've been hanging out with me and Kaki and watching this show. Back in the day, she used to hit me all the time. All the time. Almost every single Hello, night. Hello, Stray Cat. Get, Hello, Anne. <laughs> we'd get smacked and slapped, and you two didn't like that much. So they started... Uh, would, YouTube didn't do anything. Would they? Yes, they did. They well, if you if it happened during the middle of the show, it was fine. But remember, like the little playful things in the beginning or the ending would be cut off when we, I would upload it. Do you ever run with your dog? No. You <laughs> held her down and used the zester to shrink garlic on her hair. <laughs> All right, huge. What brand of fruit crunch do you lose? Do you use homemade? You can't buy my fruit punch at the store. You can buy some ingredients from certain stores, but you can't buy this exact exact drink from the store. Uh, I don't know if I could do a run with the dog. Um, I think you probably. I don't think I would lucky. like it. I don't think I would like it. I think it would be. I guess you'd have to train them. Dude, I've been watching your videos for months. Uh, the fact you and your wife remind me of, of me. me. And... Uh, 
What did Cortland say? When the fiance? Oh, when the fiance and I get into a fight, I just pour out his wine on the floor. Court. I won't do that. Oh, no. He won't do that. Nope. He knows better. <laughs> Pours out my wine. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. <clears throat> Just he'll, be getting, for a, he'll be getting more than just a remote. <laughs> just asking for a mud hole to stomped in me. <laughs> All right. So that's a win. I would definitely do that again. Yeah, that was good. The bite that I had was really good. <sighs> now, to the main event. Air fried Sicilian pizza. Will this be good? <clears throat> yup. Did when, you guys used to watch Full House? When, yes. When, it's a very sad day. When we were little. Bob Saget passed. It was one of my favorite shows as a kid. It gets bad, then I take out the air. Then I take the air out of his tires. Do you really? I always win. <laughs> See now? <laughs> wow. Khaki garlic thighs. Are those cinnamon rolls? These are garlic. These are... This is left over from, from, um, Happy last Garth night. Happy Garth <laughs> See, you don't waste food. Just so happy. And there's still more pizza in there. Yeah, I know. I wasn't really hungry tonight, guys. That's why I didn't go crazy with making something. I made a nice homemade light dessert that I just so happened to eat after my vegetables. And we Howdy, ate it. partner. And you ate it cold. Yes, Paisley, I would always eat rice pudding cold. Hey, but Kate, when I worked garlic knots. in my previous job, they made rice pudding and they would serve it hot. That mine was warm. <sighs> hot rice pudding with cinnamon on top is so good. So good. And I never had hot rice pudding before, but it was delicious. You yeah, love warm the, rice pudding. I never had was. it warm before or hot. I always ate it cold. Because pudding is usually served cold. Once I had it hot, totally changed it. So good. Mine was warm. Mine was good how it was. Yeah. Like I said, I think it would be a lot better if I if I didn't use the cheesecake flavor, and I used like regular vanilla. My wife is awesome. You guys are like us, us in, our in our dreams. Keep living your best life. We love to follow. Thank you oh, very thank much. Thank you. You ever put on a shirt? Well, Donald, I just took off my shirt right after I finished my vegetables to start eating. You see, I make a mess out of myself. Yeah, I'm right? having a salad. Are you guys still... Oh, I'm not really fasting. Jimmy. I do, chooch. Just not really so fast. much on the weekends. I do. I don't like eating during the day. And when I do <laughs> snack, I immediately regret it. <laughs> because it opens up this dark... <laughs> dark doorway to old habits and nothing is off and I just give myself excuse after excuse to just enjoy the day then I feel like garbage and don't want to cook anything and My usually order takeout gave us rice for an upset rice pudding for an upset stomach growing up I'm sure it helped mm. do Did we you... actually go out and eat no no it's been a while do you guys yeah we had a good Christmas yeah, very good. How was holidays. yours? I hope you had a good Christmas too, Kate. <clears throat> like restaurants. Yeah, no. No, we... it's been a while. No, we like doing this. Hello from Vancouver Island, Canada. Hello. You've been drinking and eating? Yeah. I haven't been so strict, huge. I need to get back on my... I've been get, I need to get back on my, my shit. Whenever you're ready. Whenever you're ready, it's going to be there waiting for you. You know, you just got to go in, into it with a, with a game plan, right? I always, I always say this. As easy as it is to have a bad day and then have, like, that quicksand where it's just another bad day and another bad day, same goes for having a good day. You could have a good day and, you know what, you could feel so good that you want to have a, another good day tomorrow and that can set you on a snowball effect too you know what I mean like I, I don't do it days I do it like uh, bad habits throughout the day so if I have let's just use this as an example if I have a snack 
in the afternoon, I'll go immediately into a quick sand effect where I'll have another snack. And then whenever my mom or Kaki made the kids for dinner, I'll have that. And then before I know it, I've given up on the day and I'll say, I'm like, I'll take today as a loss and try again tomorrow. But when you have a good day, meaning I don't get up for a midnight snack, I don't pick at whatever khaki made the kids, uh, I do a full 24 hour fast, I feel great. And then I'm, it sets me on that, that road to have another good day the next day. So you could go both ways. So you just need one good day and then the fo a follow up and then you got yourself a little streak going. Hey Care Bear. Oh, hello Care Bear, how you doing girl? doubling my drinking tonight because I had to take the kids to their tournaments this morning. Oh. <laughs> You're rewarding yourself. I understand that. What's new, Care Bear? I hear footsteps, Kagi. I'll be right back. Somebody just came in. I think it was your brother. It sounded like little footsteps. No? Right. I heard the door shut and then I heard the footsteps going up the stairs. Jamie isn't feeling well. I don't have a choice. I have to eat with meds I take. What kind of dressing? Um, this is what I use, Gina. Simply 60. Or Zeddy. <clears throat> Annette, the homeschooling did not go well last week. I was I think I was happier than the kids were on Friday when school was canceled because of the snow. I have three more days of remote learning. Yeah, I did wrestling. Pray for me, please. I tried football. Send yeah. me some wine. Coach do threw me off the do. field the first day of practice. So I asked a stupid question. You ever eat without TikTok? Uh, yeah, sometimes. But um, usually we're just live on YouTube. MB answered that already. Did she? I didn't see mm -hmm. it. <clears throat> I like eating with TikTok. I like me and Kaki. Prayers for Kaki, yes, please. Pray for me, guys. We both enjoy eating... Uh, doing this show we've been doing the show for four and a half years so it's it yeah. would kind of be weird not to do it you know we started off started off on Facebook and then uh, turned in that turned into Instagram and then YouTube and then YouTube and Instagram <laughs> and then just Instagram and then TikTok and YouTube and then there was actually there was Twitch, Twitch too Twitch, which Twitch was thrown in there too at one point which we didn't like. Mm -mm. You don't know how you found us? Well, oh, you're glad you did? Oh, thank you. This is our family time. Such a great time to have an hour away from the BS. Oh, thanks, Court. Yeah. And you know what? It's funny because some people stumble on here on accident, right? And they don't know. They don't understand what we're doing. Yeah. But here's the thing. If, if, you, if you take time to just listen and maybe look <laughs> on our story and how this happened and and, and what we did and how and what we're doing uh i think you would understand a, a little bit better it's not just two clowns eating dinner uh on social media it's a little bit more than that there's more meaning to it <clears throat> jamie you need to use the same conditioner as kathy her hair is i don't growing. use i don't use anything i want to in my see hair. your curls homie what <laughs> He said, I want to see your curls, homie. <laughs> Jamie does not have curly hair. Yeah, if I don't, if I don't, I don't wash my hair. I don't use product in my hair. So, if I don't brush it and I just let it out, it, you get, it gets, it's got some curls. That's a nice kitchen. Thank you. Thank you What's your much. Reddit? We're not on Reddit. What is Reddit? That's like, um, it's kind of like a Facebook almost. Oh yeah, and I'm not on Facebook either. What ethnicity are you, Kathy is having, yes, I'm having a salad, whoever asked. I'm Italian. Hello, Billy Majority Joe. Majority is Italian. Well, I now know that I'm predominantly Italian. Uh, what's up, John? Hey, John. Full? Question mark? I wasn't really hungry tonight. Hence why I have leftover air fried pizza. And, you know, I could have been perfectly fine with my vegetables and my rice pudding. <clears throat> I found Jamie and Kat. Ah, Munchkin. Mm. 
We don't say that name around here no more. No, we don't talk about Jamie, that, it was wet and, <laughs> Jamie, it was wet and cold running. Was it oh. wet and cold running? Oh, what? Yeah. It, it was nice It was nice, raining, though. though. Was it raining when you were running? <laughs> yeah. Yep. It was. It was nice. What's your channel on YouTube? Uh, my name. Same name, Jamie Van Lemer. If you go to his, um, his um, TikTok, if you click on that little plus button, that little arrow button, it will bring you to either his Instagram or the YouTube, and then you can go from there. Go to the YouTube. Mm -mm -mm -mm. How far did you run today? Six and a half miles. I've done 23 and me. You did 23 and me. That's um, like what I did. Jamie, do you like, like pastrami? Ancestry. I do. <clears throat> I do. I like pastrami a lot. I don't. I don't eat it that much though. When I do eat it, it's usually a Reuben. Paisley, was there any reason you did 23 and me? How does that or go? Or you just wanted to like see like your breakdown? How does that go? It's with... the same thing that is ancestry. It gives you like a breakdown, and that will like give you matches. Oh, okay. Yeah, I do. I it's usually six and a half to seven miles every day. <clears throat> I found you on TikTok, and then you came over to YouTube. Yeah, depending on what kind of view you prefer, YouTube's got more of a fuller view where you can see a little bit more of everything. And then the TikTok is the horizontal, where it kind of, it, it gives you only so much. And the ancestors were a bonus. Oh no, oops, no problem, Munchkin. It's all good, girl. I usually just say, listen, Munchkin, I, we usually get it every once in a while, and I usually just ignore it, but we love you, and I didn't want, you know. <laughs> Shoots, did you do it yet, or did you just do it? Has there been a time you haven't been able to run for, say, a week? <clears throat> uh, not in the last five months. I'm doing a test, but I'm not sure which one's better. Well, Annette, I did the Ancestry only because that's the one that I kept seeing on, you know, Longless Family. I don't know if you watch, like, um, TLC, because I was addicted to Longless Family for the longest time. You did it two weeks ago. Okay. So you're, you're going to wait for a while for your results. Um, so that's the reason I did the Ancestry DNA test. And I'm glad I did because... Yes. Yeah. Look what I found. <laughs> I found a whole freaking family that I didn't know existed. Your body, your body must feel real different when you didn't run every day. Oh, it does. I'm in pain every day. <laughs> <laughs> but I feel great at the same time. How big is your house? This is a double wide. Pretty big. <laughs> it's a double wide. <clears throat> hey, no one told me dinner was ready. Hello, Kimmy. Yeah, we're early tonight. Hey, Kimmy. How are you, girl? It's usually we're starting to eat. About now, I could use a couple oh extra minutes. Oh my god, to eat. Paisley! Jackie, I was matched with my second cousin. They contacted me, and come to find out, one of my cousins had a baby and gave it up Tough for song. adoption. She was looking for her birth family. Oh my god, that's insane! That's crazy. I don't like your salad. You don't like my salad? Well, I didn't make it for you. I'm just saying, I don't like the dressing. And plus, I like the salad last night, the Greek salad. That's going to be the go-to going forward. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty full. Give me full. it back. Take it back, because I don't want it. <laughs> Give me it back, because I like it. Hassan, I said hello to you, brother. Didn't want you to think I was ignoring you, just I didn't want to over-talk on... Uh, what Kaki was saying? Just, just not, just the, not olives. the olives. I don't yeah, have no. olives. No, last night the salad. I, I'll be making sure to order it next week with no olives. I like the olives. I'll pick the olives out. I like my normal places olives. These, the, the whole olives. Not Those are black olives. What they gave you last night? Or Kalamata olives. And I like those. Yeah, well, Kalamata olives could stay at the restaurant next time. <laughs> I won't do any of this nonsense looking for family. <laughs> I'm pretty, pretty sure, sure I'm related, related to my fiance. <laughs> hey, Carlin, that makes two of us. She's my sister. No. 
We're not related. I did a DNA test. We are not related. <laughs> <Me wouldn't even. laughs> it turns out that she was. If that were the case, your mom would have popped up on my side. Still could happen. <laughs> no. Listen. Nope. I joke. I hope so. <laughs> actually, I know you joke. I don't know if you actually I know you joke. joke. What you got for you dessert? You don't know court jokes? Hey, Donald, I ate my dessert first. I made a homemade rice pudding. It was delicious. Will you decorate the same at your new place because it looks really cool? It's um, having their can-can it, sale on olives. <laughs> I'll just stock up, Marie. I love olives. I'm sorry, what's that? You guys have probably been asked this before, but how did you to me, if you don't mind me, how did we meet? Uh, karaoke. And when it comes to the decorating our new home in Florida, uh, the set itself will be very similar. It's just, it's obviously going to be at a different, different um, house. But take a little bit from the old and then mix it in with a little bit of the new and go from there. I'm a creature of habit, right? And this is very comfortable for me. How I have the lights a certain ways and the colors, that will all be the same. So it, it'll, it'll, the set will look <gasps> somewhat similar. Um, we met at karaoke, Mary, <laughs> uh, Lisa. We met at karaoke. Okay, there are some videos on YouTube. So my mom could watch them because they were too long to send. There's a bunch of views, super weird. Makes me really uncomfortable. Yeah, well, you know, Chooch, uh, a lot of kids are, yes, I understand where you're coming from. Yeah. But a lot of kids are also getting into, what do you, do you put as the title? Because if it says wrestling, you know, a lot of kids are going to look up into that, into wrestling. To see how, you know, how it's done or to see how violent little kid wrestling could be. Oh, they just want to, like, watch. I don't know. Which one of you two... Which one of you do karaoke? Well, Kagi Car we does both the Kagi do. does the karaoke. I'm the real singer of the family. Okay. Mm. We both karaoke. We did, but I'm the one that sounds really, really good. <laughs> you know, the one that brags is the one that's really not good. So. <laughs> I, I, I'm the one that's really, really, really good. Oh my God, guys, listen to me. I back it up. I can back it up too. I back it up. They're Thank both you, amazing. Kimmy. Thank <laughs> you, Y'all have Carl. a good day. You too, Donald. Thanks for popping in. Oh, have a good night, Donald. Yeah, Chooch, is there any way you could set like your YouTube to like? You probably could set it to private. You can. Private or like followers only or subscribers only. Like where you can just like approve people. To, I don't know. I don't know if that's like a setting you can do on YouTube. I'm not sure. You can set your profile to private on YouTube. <clears throat> you definitely can. Let's hear you sing, mister. I'm the one that sings really, really good. <laughs> well, you can actually, you know, see me singing on my own TikTok. Acapella. <clears throat> do you do organized runs like 5Ks Without and Jamie marathons? I've never me. done it. No. I kind of run wherever my feet take me. An executive at Sony actually said Kathy was an amazing Broadway type singer. Fact. Uh -huh. Thank you, Kimmy. Yeah. That's true, Kimmy. That is a fact. <clears throat> and uh, I guess considering we're throwing out facts here, Cara Deer Guadi let me <laughs> sing longer than Kathy and her friend. No. When we tried out for no. American Idol. Jamie's Jamie's thirty seconds me. felt like a lifetime. Kathy got cut short. To Jamie, her I did not get cut, cut short. short. I got over thirty seconds. <sighs> Just to say something, something, you know what I mean? She's laughing at you. <clears throat> and this is before I knew who Cara Diaguati was, because she had no makeup on, she had a baseball hat, hair and a pony. <clears throat> How do I find you on TikTok? Gaggy? Me? He, she could say hello. I'm going to say hey in the chat. I just said hey. There she is. Alright, so, I'm not eating the rest of the house if you want them. Mm -mm. I had a little bit of what your dad made. 
It was and good. That, made, that was so good, but it was like super filling. And I did not have a whole lot of it. <clears throat> what, did he, what was it called? I don't even know. Some kind of chicken. It was like some sort of chicken with like this garlic gravy sauce that had like marinated mushrooms and sun-dried tomatoes were marinated in like white wine. Oh, oh butter. I knew that. It was so good. Oh, and bacon too. There's bacon in there as well. Can't wait. Hi, Haley. You do that for me. No, I'm hungry. <laughs> Sounds like, it's not a cacciatore. They're, well, gravy, I mean like actual like gravy, not sauce. Because we don't call gravy sauce around here. Sauce is sauce. Gravy is gravy. Gravy's brown. Sauce is red. <laughs> we don't make big deals out of that. <laughs> <laughs> but we don't call sauce gravy. <laughs> hey, brown eyes. <laughs> yeah, no, my dad. My dad cooks like every once in a while, but when he does, he he, he bangs out uh, something really good. But if I die or at work, it's still one day to have access to them. I don't know. Today was the first time I have to work at the Kinks and just did it. Did it for, for your mom. mom. Gotcha. Well, if your mom had like WhatsApp, you could definitely send like longer videos and like send them in like increments. I think you can send up like a six minute video on WhatsApp. Just that's to say how, pizza is better than the air fryer. That's how, you know, my, my sisters and my brothers and I communicate is through WhatsApp because we can send a hell of a lot longer videos, especially the kids, to each other. Where are you guys located? New York. Ah, she does have WhatsApp. Slash Try New WhatsApp Jersey. instead of YouTube. On the border. <clears throat> or like six to eight minutes. I believe you can send up to like a six minute long video. What is that on this thing? On WhatsApp. Oh, it looks like a gopher. I thought it was And even if you there. have to like send half the video and then the other half of the video, that way you're not putting it on YouTube. Because I know. Macho there's like, on. there's weirdos on there. Oh yeah, David? Macho Man on Arsenio Hall. I'm in Chicago. Uh, Power Cities Unite, like Hulk and the Savage in 91. <laughs> <laughs> Mega Powers. Hello, David. <clears throat> Mach Macho Man on Arsenio Hall, awesome. You know, I remember when I started tape trading with my friends in like middle school, and one of the tapes he had given me was uh, Macho Man vs. Hulk Hogan. It was Hello, Twist and Sister. Wasn't a TV. Sh it wasn't a TV match, so I don't know how how the hell he got Cheers, it. Cheers, girl. And it was Macho King versus Hulk Hogan, and I remember it being. I guess because it wasn't TV, it wasn't all lit up and bright. It was dark. <clears throat> it was very dark. Jamie, I want curls. <laughs> Did y'all hear about Bob? Sat. Yeah. Yeah. Sad, John. Very sad. Uh -huh. Alright, I'm done not eating those garlic knots. I got one more bite of the pizza. And then that's it. I gotta charge my speaker for work tomorrow. I got a decent amount of podcasts that I get to listen to. I'm looking forward to it. About who? Well, Bob Saget passed away today. Actually, yesterday. Not today, because it's after midnight. No one's looking at... Yeah, but <laughs> no one's looking at the whole midnight counting today as yesterday. I bet people really do believe that. Certain people, Chooch. All right, you done? I'm done. Kaki, I just went to your page and listened to you sing, and you are amazing. And then I scroll through. Oh, thank you, Lisa. Thank you, girl. Mwah. Thank you for listening. A duet with William White? <laughs> Who's that? Where I threw my ring. Oh. Whitey. Whitey 18. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one. All right, guys. Thank you for hanging out with that us. That was Jamie approved, by the way. It was, yeah. No, well, you posted it first. No, yeah. I asked you before I posted it. Did you? Yes, I did. Hmm. 
kind of remember seeing Jamie it. curls tomorrow. Oh now. yeah, hair will be down tomorrow. <laughs> All right, guys, thank you for hanging out. We will see you tomorrow. Good night.